Pallet Bench Ideas 5 Easy Steps to Build an Outdoor Patio Bench Materials Needed Pallet made of sturdy oak or oak and pressure treated lumber AFT pressure treated 2x4 Box of Star Header Torx No drill needed Self-tapping 2.5 index screws Tools needed Circular saw or reciprocating saw with a wood cutting blade Nail pulling crowbar Hammer Power screw gun Tape measure Carpenter's square Marker Step 1 Convert pallet to bench and come back to I chose this 48 inches by 42 inches oak pallet. Note that it has a broken bar, but it's a bar that I will remove anyway. My plan is to turn pallets into benches and benches, with just 6 saws, and 2x4s on all fours, but that will happen later. Then I marked the same 17 inches from the end of each of the 4 main cross sections that I was going to make my cuts on. After setting my circular saw to cut about 2 inches deep, I cut along the marks, flipping the pallet over to complete the cuts on the other side as the boards were too deep for a single cut. From there I took the newly molded shorter pallet, the back bench, and stacked it vertically on the longer part, the bench, which I laid flat. Now you can see the couch take shape, that sort of thing. Step 2. Making the footrest armrest next, I cut the 2x4 into what will also serve as the footrest and armrest. Cut the 2x4 into 4 pieces of 21 and 3 quarters inches each. Step 3. Secure the legs to the bench next. I lifted the bench on the blocks, the back of the seat 8 inches from the floor and the front of the seat 10.5 inches from the bottom. After double checking the measurements of the front, I still have the bench in place so the front bottom of the bench is 10 inches from the ground. To make sure the front bracket is perpendicular to the ground, I pass 4 screws on each front leg. Attach them to the front of the sides of the bench. Step 4. Fabrication and fixing of the handrail. Do you remember this pallet that I detached at the start of the project? In the photo you can see that I stretched the legs of the chair, front and back, to make the armrests of the bench. I cut at an angle where the left part hangs behind the back seat and finally put two screws through the arm, in the rear and front legs, securing it to the bench. Step 5. Sit and enjoy.